Oh, you didn't see that. Um, Tenekoto, Tenekoto, Tenekoto Katoa. My name is Oliver and this is... Hannah. And we'll be your MCs for tonight. Right, so look at all these beautiful people and uh, beautiful ladies and smashing gentlemen. I know, right? We should ask them to sing along. Uh, what do you have in mind? I have two songs in mind. And I'm pretty sure most of you guys will know the lyrics to them. Anyone want to guess what songs they are? Interesting. Close, close. Close. Actually, the answer is... May we please invite everyone to rise up for the Malaysia and New Zealand National Anthem.
Well, well, well. Seems like we have a good crowd here tonight. Actually, I don't even know what's going on. I just thought this is like a Christmas party. I mean, <laughs> that's why I dress up for Christmas party. <laughs> okay, bro. I'll explain it to you. This is basically the Malam Malaysia 2017. a night of Malaysian culture bombardment. There will be lots of singing, acting, dancing, and last but of course not least, delicious Malaysian cuisine to end the night. Our times consists of normal students just like you and me, from different cultural backgrounds, and they have put in very hard work in making tonight possible. Bagus! Bagus. Here comes the Malaysian jargon. Can you explain to us what does bagus mean? Oh, bagus, it means good in Malay, which is our national language of Malaysia. So it's made up of two syllables. B-A-B-A-G-U-S, goose. Bagus. Can you repeat after me, guys? Bagus. Oh, bagus, bagus. Okay. Now, let us start with some introduction. There are some VIPs who are here with us tonight that we would like to acknowledge. First of all, we have Dr. Ross James, Dean of Commerce, Mr. Samia, CMSI, Mr. and Mrs. Andrew and Wendy O. Hannah Vu, International Business Development Coordinator, Associate Professor Richard Fisher from the Accounting Department. Now, we would like to invite the President of CMSA, President Adam, to have a few words. Good, Mr. President. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> Thank you, my masters of ceremony, Oliver and Hannah. You guys are real weird duo. <laughs> um, thank you for that form of ent entertainment where you guys didn't turn on the mics, but you know, we may all make mistakes. Anyway, good evening, everyone. And first and foremost, I would like to say, welcome to Malam Malaysia 2017. Uh, what a crowd we have here tonight. Thank you guys for attending. First of all, I would like to thank all you distinguished guests, my sponsors, and each and every one of you here tonight for the love and support for our club CMSA and towards our annual event, Malam Malaysia 2017, Penatai. As some of you may not know, or may already know, Malam Malaysia is CMSA's biggest annual event of the year. Um, so, you know, in the past, CMSA used to host annual gala dinners, which is kind of boring, I guess. Um, but that all changed in 2015, where we took the steps toward a musical production. This year, it marks the third musical production, and you know what they say, third time to charm. So, we use Mala Malaysia as a platform for students to show their hidden talents and to showcase our unique Malaysian culture. Last year, our theme was centered around Fano, which means family. And this year, Penatai. So, what is Penatai, you may ask? Alright, so, Penatai is actually an Iban word, which is one of the natives of Sarawak, which is in East Malaysia, and it means origins. Origins is something we want to emphasize this year as we, who are Malaysians, always embrace our origins no matter where we go. This year, we were blessed to have our very talented director and ever-present producer, sorry, director Iman Razak and our ever-present producer Supri Ko to lead a cast and crew of over 70 people from different cultural backgrounds. If you could, I would like a round of applause in the country. In conjunction with Malaysia's 54th year of formation, we have come up with the title Panatai to go back to our origins. So, some of you here who are well versed and knowledgeable, you may ask and think, why is it 54 and not 60? I'll give you a fun fact for the night. On 31st of August 1957, 
The Federation of Malaya was the one that actually gained independence. So it is not Malaysia that was formed on the 31st of August 1957, which makes it 60 years. But actually, the day, 16th of September 1963 was when Malaysia was formed and when Sabah, which I'm from, and Sarawak joined up to form Malaysia. Yeah, so um, yeah, that's enough information from me for tonight. I know you all are just dying to see the show. So, get, get ready for the show tonight and witness the story of Serini, our main character, which is the blood, sweat, and tears of our cast and crew for the past six months. I'm so, so proud to witness their passion and dedication over the past six months, as most of them started with little to no experience to become the stars that we will expect today. I can't wait to show you what's in store, so that is it from me, and I hope you guys enjoy the show, and thank you again for the support. Just a shout out to our Asylum Malaysian Students Contingent for coming all the way up here to support us. Thank you guys. Thank you, President. Those are very happy words. <laughs> right, now we would like to have a few words for one of our esteemed VIPs, Mr. Andrew Roll. history. Now, when I read the synopsis, there were lots of stories about my mum having to go back to Malaysia in the, in the 60s meeting uh, uh, my father's mother who couldn't speak a word of English, which just rang true with me, some of those comments. But my father, for my dad, education was paramount. So the opportunities that he was given through coming to UC literally changed the path of his life. So much so, that this year he's giving Malaysian students of today the same opportunities through a scholarship that he set up and it's called the Tan Sri Datuk O Sunam Malaysian Scholarship. You can read about that in your program on the, uh, for this uh, great event. If any of you have any questions about that, you can come and see me afterwards. It's our goal to make you and your friends and family aware of this tremendous opportunity and I stand here in front of you as proof of how education can change your life. And while I'm here and doing so, I urge you to also investigate the other scholarships and grants that are available through the UC Scholarships Office. You never know where it may take you. Trimba Kase, Salam Malam. On behalf of 
behalf of CMSA, um, we would like to present a token of appreciation. Um, President Adam, if you could. Six. 
Notice me. Notice me, say bye. Who's moving so 
she's special. She's just like any other girl. She's not just any other girl. She's different from the rest of us. Do I always want you to leave this place and go for? I'll definitely miss it. Where is it? Really sure. And you won't mind 
eventually do this type of courses, do you? You know, Tsuri. Of course I'll support you, Tsuri. As long as you know what you want to do and you enjoy what you're doing. Thank you, Papa. But, Mama? She's a bit of a tough nut to crack. <laughs> but I'm sure sooner or later she will understand, Tsuri. I hope so too. How's it? Order up, table ten. Even 
I'm kind of in the middle of something right now, so I can't, I, I can't talk to you that way. Okay, then, sorry I bothered you. Um, good luck whatever you're doing there. Thanks. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
I'm just nervous. It's my first time here. Um, no, no, no. You're not telling me the truth. That's not why. Why is it? Tell me. Well, I'm just wondering what if your family, what if they just don't like me? Oh, my God. Nonsense. They're definitely going to love you. I have a very charming character. You'll do good. Trust me, okay? Okay. Mama? Serini? Oh, Serini, I've missed you so much! Yes, my precious Serini. I've missed you guys so much! And why is there so many people? Everyone's here to welcome you home. This way! You guys should have been thinking about it! Nonsense! We haven't seen you in two years! We just want something big to surprise you! Aww, thank you. So, how was your flight? It was great! Um, I miss Malaysian food so much, so I, I get nasty lemak on the way here. <laughs> it's always about food with you, it's really. It's good to have you back. It's good to be back. Oh, um, who's this, Serena? Really? Oh, right. Over to um, Martha. This is Ben, my boyfriend. I've been telling you guys about. Ah, so this is Ben. It's good to finally meet you. Yeah, it's nice to meet you too, Joseph. I swear to God. Who's me? Take off your 
shoes. I'm really sorry. Uh, yeah, what lie that boy? He come to my house, dirty is my fault. I swear this house is morning for him and he throws the rug and dirty is it. Mama, calm down. He didn't know it. He didn't do that back to me, is he? So every house is in New Zealand got to this boss house. <laughs> Remember when he was younger, he's always in my house looking at the 
fish. <laughs>
no messages, no calls. Why is she still in there? Where could she be? You! Where is she? <laughs> what? Don't act and I said, I, I'm, I'm really sorry, but I really don't know what you're talking about. She's gone, Ben. She's not like this. What did you do? Um, Joseph, calm down, please. Oh. Why, why don't you, why don't you ask Vic? Yeah, uh, maybe he took her out last night. How dare you? You're putting this on Vic now? He would never do this. You know, just tell us where she is. I really don't know where to talk. Watch it. Watch it towards Ben. And I thought you were the guy for me. Definitely not. You just I have to stop you right there. Oh. I love her to this. I love Serene to this. Isn't that the only thing that matters? I don't know what she sees in you, Ben. <laughs> you don't know what for her. You have no respect for us or our home. That's not true. I don't want her in her life anymore. She's obviously changed, and you're the reason why. Joseph, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry that you felt that way, but... No, but! Just get out of my house! Please! I don't care. Siri is not here anyway. What's the point of me sticking around? Go back to New Zealand. I don't care. I'm just having it with you. Joseph, if you'll just listen. Just get out. We all come back to beautiful people. You know what else is beautiful? Ah, that's easy. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> What about our second lucky draw? Yeah! Now, um, we would like to invite one of another VIP, Miss Hena Wu, to do the um, picking the lucky man. And, uh, <laughs> There's five of them, goes 10, 10, 20, 20, 50. Oh. So the first lucky number is 118. 118. remember the last one.
180 degrees. 180, 180. All right, two digits. One, three. 13, very lucky number. Alright, our grand prize, fifty dollars. Good for twenty-five two dollar rice. Um, lucky number two zero zero. Really? 
Lido. I'm so worried about her. You worry for what? A boy? Look around you. The whole Say so. Oh yeah, by the way, what's the occasion today? Why is there so many people around here? Oh! Yeah, it stops, right? Uh, today, uh, today yeah. is the Malaysia celebration day! But isn't that on like 31st of August?
Sorini? What? Okay, I'll meet you there, fine. Five minutes? Yeah, okay. Ah, see? Five minutes, huh? You better go now, lah. I'll go home now, boy. Okay, thank you, Sorini. Bye bye! And your parents kicked me out 
and somehow all these events, it's my fault. You know what? If you're gonna be like this, I don't wanna have this conversation. Are you just gonna run away like this? How you did last night? You're unbelievable. You're better than this. Nothing! 
out of all the bad competitions I've been in, you two were only there once. What? And for Serini, you went for all her netball competitions. Why are you bringing this up? Do I get to study marine biology like I always wanted to? No, but Serini, she'll just go to you and she'll always have it her way. Alex, please. Alex, let's talk about this first. Forget it. It's not like I was ever part of this family anyways. <gasps> Tell me about Bella. I know, right? Tell me about Bella. Oh, 
me about it. Okay. Are you okay? What's wrong? Oh, it's just Ben's been giving me the skin tie ever since he got here. <laughs> I'm not sure what's wrong. Well, he's had a hard time. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Really? What happened? My parents got mad because I was not home and they thought I, I ran away and it was because of him. Wait, you didn't tell them you were with me last night? I didn't feel like talking to them, let alone text them or anything. Oh my god. No wonder lah. What? He knows that you were with me last night and now you two are fighting. Maybe. He probably thinks I'm an outright dick right now. <laughs> Why are you two fighting anyway? He was blaming me that he got kicked out. It's not my fault my parents are like that. You're about to hate me, Serene. But it is your fault. Oh. You should have at least texted your parents. Oh, Ben! He's your boyfriend, for God's sake. Not you, too. Alright, whatever. Lah. I know I was involved in your mess. Well, that's that supposed to mean. I'm going to talk to Ben, trying to sort your mess up on my sister's wedding.
sorry for all the things that happened to you. You didn't deserve any of it. It was really all my fault. It's not all your fault. I shouldn't be so childish for like picking up a fight with you. So, are we cool now? You know it. As long as you forgive me, we're cool. As you, you can't move. <laughs>
auntie, uncle. I'm so sorry for everything that's happened. No, man. I am the one who should apologize. Especially for yelling at you and kicking you out of the house. That was really uncalled for. I was so harsh on you, Ben. I'm very sorry. It's fine. It's all over now. I know you two were just trying to protect your only daughter. I hope we can put all of this behind us and start over again. That will be great. I'm really looking forward to get to know you better for the next couple of days, Ben. Me too. And I hope this time you will accept me. Oh, look, it's lunchtime. I'm going to bring lunch out for everyone. Serene, Alex, please help me out in the kitchen. Ben, have a seat. I still have to ask you something important. Just ask away. What are your future plans with Serene exactly? Are you planning on marrying her? Build a family maybe? <laughs> well, uncle, you see, I have every intention to stay with Serene for as long as it's possible. Even the time dies. But you see, we haven't reached that stage of our relationship yet. And I'm sure that Serene, she'll want to focus on her career before anything else. And I myself, I have to find a stable job first to provide for the future. But with everything that I have, I promise you, I'll protect her and I'll guarantee her a good future. Well, that's a really good answer, Ben. <laughs> I've always known you're a good guy. <laughs> but I still have to warn you though. If you ever hurt her in any way possible, I will personally go to you and I will make sure you regret the day you met me. <laughs> Just <saying> that. <laughs> That's a joke, right?
me around is guaranteed to be a happy ending, you know? <laughs> Roll, please. <laughs> Jazz music. Thank you and have a good night. 
to wear the traps on the laden trades from his probably three, four hours ago. <laughs> Courtesy of Shirley's Kitchen, Cap Nora and Cap Fika. But first we would like to invite the VIPs first to head over to our dining area. Above all, I hope you have enjoyed the show. This is Oliver. This is Hannah. From the Punatai crew, we thank you for coming. You guys have been awesome. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 